That's a fun song. Um, let's go down the list. Uh, unknown user, welcome to the Stampede, Thick Daddy. Drix, thank you for following. Swolbarham Lincoln, welcome back for 50 months in a row. And BT8, thank you for the host. We are playing 007. Let me pull it up. I had to mute it. Y'all ready? Oh, the theme song's playing too. That shit goes in. Thing or nothing at all. Hey, Azure. Welcome back, bro. We gotta listen to the jam. Oh, fuck. I have it turned down. God damn it. At all. Run it back. Run it back. Have you guys seen what actors and actresses are in this video game? When I first heard about this game and heard about all the people in it, I was like, are you sure this isn't a movie? It's insane. It's got Maya in it. Silencio, mijo. Seven Chaos and Corgi Queen at the double time? That's what's popping. Silencio, mijo. Welcome back, you guys. Yeah, we're playing. I'm playing on GameCube. I mean, I bought that. I bought that GameCube uh, upscaler, so we're gonna fucking use it because it was actually really expensive. So <laughs> we're, I, I try to buy every. I try to find every chance to use it. Black Afro Sam, welcome back, dude. I want to wait for the intro to play again. I want to listen to the whole Everything or Nothing song. Uh, Seven Chaos. Yeah, ten months. Ten months. There was one away from four. Oh, here we go. Here we go, guys. Russia. Then we unleash our little nano Green Goblin? The world. Oh, wait. This is the, the intro for the gameplay. We want to see the intro with the other shit. Hey, Melman. I might have a save file for this game already, but we're going to start a fresh one. I remember this game being a lot of fun. I don't remember ever beating it though. Hey, King Doom. I remember getting stuck. But then again, I was also a child. I actually traded someone, I think, a memory card for this game. Maya? I think I traded someone a memory card for this game when I was a little kid. Oh boy, he's like, I blow up and he started flying. Hey, yeah, Maya, the, she's a singer, I believe. I believe her name. Her stage name is Maya. Boo-doo. He chucked <laughs> clothesline and chucked that guy off the railing. You first. Game Boy XP, welcome back with the double elevens. Make a wish, honey. Come on, hit us with the Maya music. Sure, we gotta wait again? God damn it. There's a brand new subscriber. Are you sure about that? Really? Are we sure about that? Winter selling. You ain't new. It's, no, I'm kidding. So what bought me in the 007 mood? I don't know. I've been wanting to play Nightfire. But then again, I remembered, like, I played the shit out of Nightfire, like, a lot, and I never beat this one, so I was like, I kind of want to play this game. Yeah, they're going to play the intro next. Welcome back, Warner Sullen. I know that's a welcome back, because Twitch is tripping. Um, hey, did any of you guys watch the, the PlayStation shit today? With all the VR games, the only thing that I thought actually looked really cool in VR was uh, um, No Man's Sky. As much as I've heard that No Man's Sky is a lot better now, because when I played it, I enjoyed it.
Let me turn the music back down. We got all, yeah, let me let me let me read you the list of people that are in this game. Yeah, the song they use for him. I don't know. I think I just think Ed Boon just really likes rap music. But whatever. It's his game. Let him do whatever he wants, man. One thing about Ed Boon that I that even though like he makes really bad decisions sometimes, he really he makes games that he really likes. And you gotta respect that. Most most people make games that they want you to you know suck the money out of your cock. But that man makes games he likes, and you, you can't fault him for that. And he does a good job too. Like, as much as I dislike Mortal Kombat games, and I only dislike them because I just hate the fact that most Mortal Kombat games are very zoner heavy. I find zoners very lame in fighting games. I wish they weren't a thing because it sucks the fun out of fighting games. Because you play a fighting game to fight, not to run away and shoot laser beams and shit. But, um, my biggest problem with Netherrealm games is that zoners are always really OP when the games first come out until they adjust things here and there. And then zoners become like nothing. Uh, zoners are fighting characters that run away and shoot stuff. Their their whole gameplay style is keeping you away and shooting shit at you. So they zone you, they keep you in a zone away from them. It's really shitty and annoying. But um, I hate that Netherrealm games always have really strong zoners in the beginning until they adjust them to make the game more fun. And their animations are really, really stiff. Like, Injustice and, like, Mortal Kombat has really, really fucking bad animations. Like, they just look really stiff. Like, the actual gameplay. Like, the cutscenes and stuff are phenomenal. The face work and, like, the, it's really good. It's just when you're actually playing the game, like, it's just really annoying. Like, I always imagine Mortal Kombat, like, watching Mortal Kombat play, to me, always felt like imagining a little kid with action figures smacking them against each other. That's what I like. I just always thought the animations were, were shit. But the good thing about Mortal Kombat is they always gave you more than enough your money's worth. They always gave you so much. Like compare Mortal Kombat 10 to Street Fighter 5. Think about it. How much game did did Capcom give you with Street Fighter 5? They barely gave you any. They gave you like twenty five dollars worth of content in there. They didn't give you shit. They gave you a versus mode, some half ass arcade mode, and the online. Whereas like Mortal Kombat 10, what did you get a bunch of shit with Mortal Kombat 10? So that's what I look at. It's like they do give you a lot of game for your money. You do play it a lot, and I, I can respect that. I just I just didn't like the animations. I thought the animations were kind of cheap, but it was really fun. Let's look at all the people that are in this game. The cast we got: Pierce Brosnan, Judy Dench, John Cleese, Richard Clay or Keel. Willem Dafoe, Heidi Klum is in this game. Shannon Elizabeth, I don't know who that is. Who is that? Let me click it. Shannon Elizabeth. Oh, she's in this game? What? The girl from Scary Movie, they got her head cut off? Word. Shannon Elizabeth, Maya, she's an NSA double agent. James Arnold Taylor is Jack Mason. Pierce Brosnan in Mortal Kombat 10. <laughs> I wish. Yeah, there she is right there. She's kind of cute. Subtitles on, widescreen on. Boy, that's some that's some high quality JPEG right there. It is blurry as shit. <laughs> Let me see if I have a save file. I should. Papi, papi. I do. Silencio okay, mio. we're gonna start a new game. <clears throat> Nora Nephilim. What up? What up, player? How's it going? Ryan Gosling and Leonardo DiCaprio. Welcome back, dude. New game, Ground Zero. You can see uh, 007's Drive Fast and Eat Ass beard. Yeah, I don't pay attention. I don't really give a fuck about Mortal Kombat story, honestly. It never made sense. I just like playing the game. You remember that bootleg game, Vampire Ring? Yeah, I remember. That game sucks. It's terrible. I had a friend that was like obsessed with the game. He loved it. We'll just stick with Agent. That game is bad. I remember in that game, like, the multiplayer on it was fucking awful. It was funny, though. Story mode was stupid. Hey, Nova. Calidus, what up, dude? Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, the fucking vampires raining. That game is bad. That game is so bad. 
it's like borderline non-enjoyable bad. It has its moments, but it's frustrating. Vampire Rain did have multiplayer. It was terrible, but it was funny. Intelligence reports that a nuclear suitcase bomb stolen from the ex-Soviet stockpile has surfaced in southern Tajikistan. Unfortunately, it's about to change hands. The wrong hands. We cannot allow this to occur. Recover the bomb and bring it back. That's a lot of butt. Agreed. You have the device. Of course. Of course. Well, what have we here? Camper new? What's up, man? Thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying it. That's the device. Shantae 5 is coming? Yo, I'm excited. Vampire Reigns multiplayer was like, I think it was 4 on 4 uh, deathmatch with uh, random vampires spawning in. And then I think you can, if you find certain weapons, you can turn into a vampire. Um, the thing that's funny is when I used to play it with my friend, he would just cheese me. Whenever I'd turn into a vampire, you can only melee. It's a trap! It's a trap! Uh, what he would do is he would just climb on a ladder and just stand on the ladder. Because you couldn't get him off the ladder because you can only melee. So he would just do that until the vampire juice wore off and then he'd climb up and shoot me. Oh shit, we took our Z for wall cover. He said, ah! I mean, this is low-key cheating. Give him with the one arm. It's a trap! Ah, ah. This is Uncharted 2? Pretty fucking much, man. Get to that briefcase, How about you get to that goddamn briefcase? Yo, I... I, I just... I... I, I can't play for like shooters on on GameCube because like listen listen it's just the triggers are so loud <laughs> yeah it would be nice if I knew how to get down from here okay we can just go down the stairs light him up He squeezed a little bit in the air. Ah! Where's that briefcase? There we go. Find a rocket launcher. I will do it. Yeah, you wake up the whole house for you exactly right, dude. Wake up the whole fucking house playing the video games. You want to know something I used to do that was really bad when I was growing up? Um, I used to sneak and play my, and I, beautiful memories of the Dreamcast. Oh my God. So I couldn't play video games during the week. So what I would do is I would tell my dad, like, dad, I have such a hard, cause my dad would get up and go to work at around four in the morning. And I would tell him like, dad, I always have such a hard time waking up in the morning. I was like, can you wake me up so I can put my school clothes on and I could sleep in my clothes? And he's like, sure. He'd wake me up. I put my school clothes on, wait for him to leave. And then I'd get up and just play my, uh, my Dreamcast until I had to go to school at seven in the morning. So I'd play like, you know, three hours uh, at night. And it was pretty funny. I would play, uh, um, I would play uh, Jet Grind Radio and uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 2 like crazy, man. Every morning. Sonic Adventure. Oh, man. And the funny thing is my Dreamcast made noise because the Dreamcast was the first console I owned that had a fan system in it. Um... Because, you know, an N64 didn't make any noise. A PS1 only made noise when it spun the disc. But the Dreamcast had a constant, like, kind of, like, you know, like a fan blowing. Hey, Gabley, welcome back six months in a row. So I would put a blanket over it so it wouldn't make noise so I could play video games, which is awful. I probably fucking barbecued my shit. But, yeah, dude. You should totally play through and stream Bloodstone. I think we did one time. I like that game. The game is actually really, really good. That game was a lot of fun. We got rocket launchers, boy. <laughs> You're getting used on Dreamcast? 
Yeah, I really missed the Dreamcast. That was a really good console. Oh, I hit him with a missile. He hit me back. It did 10%. <laughs> James Bond took a missile to the chest and lost 10% health. What's up, Doc? Thank you. And welcome back to the Stampede, my gorgeous man. Who just dodging missiles all casually? He's taking him out of the locker room for study and ended up playing games all the time. Lock me up. I'm studying. She played at the crack of dawn. Ugh. 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 There we go. Got that love lock down. So yeah, uh, those were my times as a my life as a teenage robot. That was a lot of fun. I guess I gotta get down there. How do I reload? A button, got it. Here's a really good console, but it had really sharp buttons. You're gonna cut your thumb wide open, sliding it across. It's really depressing. You guys remember that game Blue Stinger? The Dreamcast really... It really upsets me. Oh, shit. The Dream... Didn't, the Dreamcast got just destroyed with... Oh, my God. Got destroyed with, uh... Piracy, didn't it? Yo, dog, I'm not exactly sure. I'm supposed to go out the hole in the wall, but I'm getting fucked up. And I don't know where the hole is. Oh, it's over there. Shit. What's my turbo button? Because look at that. He's on my ass. I got a plan. You guys ready for my plan? Oh, well. Never mind. It didn't work. <laughs> I thought he was going to stand over the damn ledge. God damn it. The Dreamcast died because it got the living shit pirated out of it. No one bought games on the Dreamcast. It got the piracy on it was so bad that it went out of the the game just it, it was it was really bad. I know piracy was the biggest reason, but there was there was something else too, something else about it. Yo, can you can you hit him? Shoot him in his leg, something. So you wouldn't steal a purse? Yeah, it was a great plan, wasn't it? It worked out wonderfully. Yeah, the biggest the biggest downfall of the Sega Dreamcast was piracy. I think the other was just the fact that the PS2 came out and just kind of blew it out of the water. The Dreamcast was a fantastic console, though. Like, piracy, I mean, they, I think you can still... I mean, games are really hard to find for it. So, like, getting a Dreamcast now actually is, is worth the money. I love the Dreamcast. Has some of my favorite games on it of all time. The Dreamcast is great. Yo, I want to see how awesome the shotgun is in this game. <laughs> he just backflipped like four times? Ow! Come here! <laughs> oh, I stepped on the fire. He's... Yeah, yeah, I wish they would too, right, Jugs? The only thing that Sega did is they, they made, like, a collection of games on 360. It was, like, it was, uh, what was it? It was, like, Sonic Adventure, Virtual Tennis, and some other stupid shit nobody cares about. Oh. And it was, uh, they put Sonic on there, too. I wish they'd port, port more Dreamcast games over. Now it's time to fight that helicopter again. Oh no! Did I hit him? There we go. 
the James Bond game on Game Boy, like OG Game Boy? No, nah, I have never played that one. That Sonic themed Mario Party game, Matman, as much as that game was, that game sucked, but it was so much fun. It was called Sonic Shuffle. That game was stupid. It was a terrible video game, but it was so much fun. I never got any, I never played the game story mode because not only was it just bad, it was really, really hard. So I would just play like normal modes because the game was just so much fun. Some of the mini games are so one-sided, it was hilarious. That was a really fun game, even though it was bad. Sonic Shuffle is definitely a game I wouldn't mind if... Yo, you can do that? That's... Yo, we got a 007 thing. That's cool. Where's the hole in the wall so we can leave? Oh, it's over there. Oh, what the fuck? Getting shot all up in my ass? Sonic Heroes? Didn't I blow that thing up? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Need for Speed game come out? I mean, the one that recently came out, did that one sell well? Because that game was shit. With all the loot boxes. We did one out of two Bond moments. I wonder what the other Bond moment is. I think I got... Because you need Bond moments to unlock more levels, right? I, I don't know. Maybe the other Bond moment was blowing up that AA gun. It might have been it. They don't. It sucks that they don't like give you any hints either. Oh no, they do. What the fuck is that? Does that look, that looks like, what the, f hold on, okay, wait a minute. So, th this was the first blonde, bond mo blonde moment, bond moment, is when we jumped off of there. Does, to me, does that look like a, like Sam Fisher rappling? Uh, Criterion, I don't think Criterion's dead. Criterion works, does the, does the, uh, um, most recent Criterion does the Need for Speed games. They also did the driving segments of Battlefield Five, I think. Kind of weird. No, not oh, yeah, Battlefield Five, and I think uh, Battlefront Two. Some shit like that. I don't know. Kind of looks like someone pushed over an edge. Are you sure? Because it looks like he's rappling. Because he has a gun in his hand, and then his hand. You see what? It? That looks like uh, that looks like a guy rappling, not a. I don't, because you can see him holding on. You can see the string he's holding on to, and the and the gun in his other hand. Burnout Paradise was the last, I believe. Burnout Paradise was the last uh, Burnout game we got, and they just remastered it not too long ago. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe we can Google it. Google it later. Try to figure out what these Bond moments are, because I think you need Bond moments. Oh no, you. I don't know. Our latest in stealth munitions: grenades disguised as coins. I can't remember how. I know there's a certain part where, like, you have to, like, get enough, like, 007 shit. Hey, electric gun. Okay, I get it. Production still one? Oh, boy. Yeah, I'll save.
and her name. Just call it Chops. Bust them in the Chops. 007 Chops? Okay. <laughs> Alright, fuck it. I'll do it. Hey, Parker. The most wanted reboot right now, they're just Dice Support Studio. They, like, do the driving for the Dice games. I believe Double H unlocked Platinum Challenge. We got a Back gold. Back I'm gonna training. Mijo. Okay. Mad strokes, yo, what up? Welcome back. Is this a dude with a raffle gun? Okay. Oh my god, I'm sitting here reading chat, getting my ass kicked. <laughs> hey, she cute, dog. Uh, 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 uh. mijo. Chess over here. Uh. Yo, Ryan, what? Oh! That <laughs> just punched me in the back of the head. Hey, Ryan, what's up, dude? I like the hand hand combat in this game. It's funny. It ain't like Spy Hunter funny, but it's pretty funny. Rapple. Now simply run towards the wall and you'll be able to climb it. Cool. This game is this game is really funny. Combat training. Lock on target and There you go. I'm going, I'm going. Enter Bond Sense. Bond Sense training suit when target is highlighted, hold left trigger. Oh, what the fuck? What does that do? So you use Bond Sense to know what you can aim at? I guess. He's channeling his inner white Spider Man. We can say that now because Spider Man is officially a black kid now. Now it makes sense. Like my invisible gun. We're gonna go for the headshot. <laughs> Ooh. My favorite James Bond is Pierce Brosnan, because that was the Bond I grew up with. Well, uh, is it when did Peter Parker turn black? No, um... Ooh. Um, after the, uh... Secret Wars, uh, Miles came over to the... Oh shit, oh shit. Miles came over to the, uh... Regular... The regular, uh... I can't remember, was it 616 or some shit? Whatever universe is, uh... Yeah, I know you were joking. I'm kidding. But I mean, uh, some people might not know. Uh, ever since Secret Wars, I think that was like 2016 or 2015. Uh, after all that shit happened, Miles is now in, uh... Like the official Marvel world or whatever. So it is 616. So yeah. He's not in the Ultimate Universe anymore. I don't even think Ultimate Universe exists anymore. Did I get him? Yep. <laughs> he laid down and that guy's like, wait a minute, my homie exploded. <laughs> How do I... There we go. Okay. Is there another guy? Ah, I see, I see. There's a brand new subscriber. Man, you lying. No, it ain't. Are you sure about that? Yay, yeah, Persona 3 Master. Welcome, dude. You can't Welcome to Stampede. Keep moving. I agree. Miles does have one of the best Spider-Man movies ever. Spider-Verse is an amazing movie. And you guys should, if you haven't seen it, you should do yourself a huge favor and go see it. It's really good. Really good movie. Oh, uh, Turtles in Time, I don't, no. I don't have a playthrough of that. I wanted to. You think it's coming to DVD soon? Um, of, uh, what, Spider-Verse? Spider-Verse, I think, came out on Blu-ray on the 19th, I think. Either the 19th or the 21st. It's it's out already. You should be able to get it. The Q-Spider. How do you turn? 
Oh, it turns like a tank. Okay, you can't turn. All them legs and you can't just fucking turn? You have to be moving when you turn. Oh, but now all of a sudden I can turn. Yo, how come I couldn't turn when I was inside of there? No, you're not late, Jags. We've only been live for about 40 minutes. We need to blow something up. Probably this red thing. Yeah. Well done. You yeah, the walking noise is weirdly satisfying, isn't it? Did we win? Oh, we we win. Hey, what happened to the slap chop guy? What's he been doing? Hopefully not beating prostitutes like he was before. Spider-Man 3 is one of those movies that's so bad it's good, so you can't even be mad about it. Mm. What I always say is, when you have a movie that's bad, if it's entertaining, it's not really all that bad. It's bad, but you, it's still enjoyable compared to like a movie that's boring. Like boring, boring movies are just balls. You know what I mean? We should watch the movie. We watched it already. My favorite scene in Spider-Man 3, I guess, is when Topher Grace is being a weirdo. Demonstrating top secret nanorobot technology. Microscopic machine prototypes whose technology must not fall into Yeah, what was the last um what was the last Bond game we got? Was it the uh the one that came out when Skyfall came out? Or was it Goldeneye reloaded or something? Hey, click play. We're also equipping you with our newest rapid. Oh yeah, yeah, it was Bloodstone. No, it wasn't. Was it Bloodstone? I don't know. I'll Google it. Yeah, they came out with a game when Skyfall came out, but it, it was like a... It was called 007, like, Generations or something like that. Yeah, I think Bloodstone might have been either 007 or Bloodstone. Yeah, it was 007 uh, Legends. That came out in 2012. It looks like that was the last Bond game we got. Not including uh, remasters. Yeah, 007 Legends was the last. We haven't had a Bond game since 2012. The funny thing is I bought 007 Legends for the Wii U, and it was bad. <laughs> this is too epic! We gotta go drop a bomb in there. I'm gonna kick this guy's ass. Don't you run from me. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, oh. I'm gonna drop a bomb and I'm gonna do it. I'll do it. Were any 007 games good? Yeah, like 90% of them. There's way more good, better ones than there are bad ones. Like let's 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 make a list. So which ones which ones were bad, chat? Which one would we say? In my opinion, I would say one of the bad ones was was uh uh Tomorrow Never Dies on PS1 was pretty fucking bad. Tomorrow Never Dies was like this game but shit. Like if you just took all the fun out of this game and made that game, you got it. Oops. Oops. Double O Seven Legends was pretty bad too, yeah. It wasn't even finished when the game came out. They claimed they didn't finish it because of Skyfall spoilers. Yeah, fucking right. Y'all just didn't finish the damn game. Quantum of Solace was okay. I didn't think it was bad, but it was funny. My health is hella low. Didn't even notice.
Oh, you like that? Yo, what the fuck? Why do you... Let, hold up. Did y'all see what happened? I was like 15 feet away from him trying to shoot him, but instead, Bond is like, let me run up on him and punch him as he's pumping multiple bullets in my ass. Why would you try to punch him from that far away? And then get lit up. I know the PlayStation 1 version of, uh, of, um, The World Is Not Enough was pretty bad, too. Quantum of Souls, I thought, was really fun. I enjoyed it. We are almost out of ammo. I thought we picked up one of those big guns. Hello? I, I hit him in his hip. Just, just give me the virus link. What's the best and worst 007 movies? I haven't seen all of them, so I can't really fully go in on that. I started watching them after Pierce Brosnan. I haven't really seen a lot of the older ones. I know Quantum of Solace, the movie, I didn't like very much. Casino Royale was really good, though. Fucking me up, dude. <clears throat> die another day? Yeah, low, uh, die another day was pretty bad. That's the one with, with Halle Berry, right? Yeah, that I didn't I didn't think that movie was pretty good either. <laughs> It was kind of cheeks. Boy, tried to punch me? Yo, does, does Jabon have a turbo button? Because my golly, he's slow. <laughs> There's a lot of dudes here. <laughs> Timothy Dalton's 007 Bond movies so those movies I haven't seen but I've seen a lot of clips from them I've heard from a lot of people that they weren't very good but from the clips I've seen it looks really funny but I don't know if that's what people want with a Bond movie you know what I mean I just noticed my health is low but um I die. I mean, not die. No, that tomorrow never dies. I, I remember not really liking that movie very much when I was younger. And like every time I try to watch when I'm older, I just get bored. So I just don't watch it. Oh, you ducked really good, Mister Man. His blind fire is really accurate. Hey Siri, is Halle Berry still banging? My web search. I didn't say begging, woman. Shit, banging, not begging, banging with an N. Oh, I killed him. No, I didn't. Kick his ass. He says Halle Berry still begging. He said homeless Halle Berry. <laughs> Ooh, he had a rocket launch. That's not cool. We gotta move slow, because you be dying fast AF in this game, man. Got him. Are people grappling through the ceiling? Fuck it, go. Don't shoot me! We out! Mm -hmm. 
We did it. Drop your weapon. I want to see the Timothy Dalton ones. No. Sorry, gentlemen. Soft cool. To teach you that I'm kidding. Uh, do I have a YouTube post schedule? Like, do I post on YouTube? Um, no, not really. I just try to post every day, usually around 3 p.m. Usually. Or do you mean a schedule for like Twitch? Because on Twitch, my old schedule used to be Thursday through Monday, four to eight, or three to seven. But um, I was like overworking myself. I was like just forcing myself to do it when I just wasn't really digging it and so it was just kind of wearing me down so now I just kind of stream when I'm like in a really good mood you know I just don't want to I don't want to run it in the ground you feel me oh that's weird just change the resolution mid game The invisible car. Oh boy, that was awful. Oh, cow can dude, flaming fireball hits dam. Now we're boned. So you can, I think you, I think right here you can choose to take the bike or the car. I'm gonna go for the bike. I think the bike is over here. Yeah. Oh my god, the bike handles like shit. Agent Under Fire was the first PS2 Bond game, wasn't it? That was one that I've actually never played. I played the multiplayer on it, but I never played the single player on it. Yo, who is fucking me up? Although I can't, I can't see. Hold on. What are the controls? Stuff is locking on like I can shoot. I guess I'll start just mashing buttons until we figure it out. Oh, okay, A button shoots missiles, nice. How do I look behind me so I can not... There we go, okay. This is, this is much easier now. Oh! <laughs> he, hit, he hit the wall and just ejected! Hold on, I went the wrong way. <laughs> where the fuck these Aztec temples and shit come from, dude? Where are we? Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Yo, should we just take the car? Let's just take the car. Oh, man, that's funny. I want to try the car out. Isn't the car like a, like a SUV? Marrow Heat! Welcome back, Sick Papa! Welcome back, man. Do we get a Bond moment for getting in our... Why the fuck is Bond driving like a mom... Like a... Like a mom SUV? Like... This is not even like... This is like the... I'm gonna go pick up my kids. Whoops. When did Bond ever drive a fucking SUV? A sports utility... A sports utility vehicle. He said Bond drives whatever sponsors the movie. Yeah, you're right. Bond gonna start driving a fucking... A really tiny scooter. Ah, oh, 
I saw that was a, like a ramp over there. I should have totally went on. That would have been that was probably a bond moment too. Is there a reset? Yeah, let's restart the mission real quick. We didn't get too far. Uh, hello, Bob? Hello? Oh, okay. No, I'll never know you're a secret agent if you drive one of those. You're right. Don't let your memes be dreams. Oops. So many missiles. Oh, we didn't get shit for that. I thought that was a bond moment. It's a bond moment in my heart. Hey, did you guys know they put that, uh, that pod racing game on PC? Mmm, that frame rate. Oh, it's delicious. Look at that. There you go. Bond moment. Whoa! Yo, that this train got a mortar on it. Oh. So hit the ramp full speed. Oh, bond moment. Oh yeah, that was so cool. Is this on PS2? I'm playing on GameCube, but it is on the PlayStation 2. Yes. Those two die, just die in unison. <laughs> oh, There's a brand new subscriber. Any cool toys I've gotten recently? I have not bought any recently. Are you sure about that? My most recent figure is uh, Wolfgang the Slow Mo for epicness. Jake, that's a welcome back, isn't it, Jake? Thank you, man. Welcome to the Stampede Rizzle. The most recent figure I bought is I got a Mezco. Uh, Evil Dead 2 Ash Williams. So if you want to Google it, Mezco Evil Dead Ash is the most recent figure I got. I got him maybe like a month and a half ago. It was a while ago. Before him, the last figure I got, uh, before him I got the uh, Infinity War SH figure. It's Hulk. We did one out of, I mean, two out of three Bond moments. I don't know what the fuck that is, so whatever. They want you to go back and figure it out. He just yeah right. He he climbs in the he climbs in the he climbs up in there, crouches behind the boxes and just dies. <laughs> he he does all that epic shit. He climbs onto the train, crawls behind a box and just and just falls over and dies. And so do you think WrestleMania will be good? Uh, I have my fingers crossed. I will hope it's good. I mean, it, it last the last pay-per-view is actually pretty good. So, hopefully they keep it up. Oh, I got kicked out of another South Park clan, by the way, if anyone was wondering. Because I just don't dedicate my life to South Park Phone Destroyer, because people play like shit on that game. And I don't want to play it all the time because it pisses me off. That game is fucking annoying. Is this the bounty game? No, the, the bounty game is, uh, um, you mean like the Twitch bounty? 
No, it's uh uh Sekiro. We're gonna stream probably stream it tomorrow. Because I wanna I wanted to play the game and stuff. So why not? An old friend, I see some cleavage. Am I gonna get Samurai Showdown? Probably. I probably will. What's today? Monday? Today's Monday, right? Yeah, we can stream Sakiro tomorrow for a little bit. Give me a An old game key game is a bounty? Nah, this this is I was I was I was laying in bed and I woke up this morning and I was like, I really want to play a James Bond game. Because my favorite streams so my, my biggest problem with streaming is I just never know what to play. And then when I figure out what to play, people don't want to watch it. So then I'm like, fuck, I need to figure out what I want to play that we both can enjoy, that you guys like to watch and that I like to play. And then it's a win-win. I get so jealous of other streamers that have like a that have like a game that they're like super addicted to that they really enjoy, that their audience really enjoys. Like I'm always so jealous of people like that because I never know what to play. So I was laying in bed. And I was thinking to myself, I go, what are things that I really enjoy doing? I really enjoy doing marathon games where we play through every game in a series because we always go down a really nice memory lane. You know what I mean? Like that Harry Potter marathon was so much fun. It was a lot of fun. So um, I was thinking like, what's something similar, like in the old series? And I was thinking like, well, I, I, I know I wanted to do like James Bond games. So I was like, let's play James Bond games, but which one should we play? And I'm like, well, I haven't played everything or nothing in a really long time. And I really like that game. So let's play that game. And so here we are today. And you guys seem to really be enjoying it. I'd be down to do a James Bond marathon. What do you guys think? We can skip the bad ones. Yeah, that's true, Matt, man. But we I just don't want to play Resident Evil 6. I have to, but... Ugh. We'll get to it. Fucking Resident Evil 6. I came so fucking long. Jason, your face. Welcome back to Stampede, dude. I'd be down for a Bond marathon. I own the majority of the games. I think the only ones I'm missing... I don't think I have Agent Under Fire. I don't think I ever bought that one. Um, I don't own From Russia With Love either. Um, I'd have to rebuy 007 Legends because I am not fucking playing that on the Wii U. No, thank you. I am not playing that. We did a Dead Rising Marathon already, but we can do it again. But we we did a Dead Rising Marathon. Find Doctor Nadanova. Destroy six missile launch computers. But I'm still checking. Yo, where'd my health go? Why is my health not back? How do I stealth kill? Oh, well. You like how it told me that after I did it? Oh, shit. Destroy six of these. Oh, my nose. DMC marathon? Yeah, about that. I don't really want to play any of them but four and five. I'm not playing two. Um... Devil May Cry 1 is kind of annoying. And I, I personally just don't really like 3 very much. So I'd only play like 4 and 5. Devil May Cry 3 frustrates me. Metal Gear Solid Marathon was a... Uh, was a... Uh, oh shit. Was a... um Like a sub-goal that we were working towards, but we never got to it, so... We probably have to skip MGS5. I have to sneeze really bad. Oh yeah, definitely. I gotta sneeze. Hold up. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Remember last time I, w I had the sneeze and I muted my the stream and you guys just heard a full-on sneeze? I wouldn't mind playing Metal Gear again. I'd have to mod MGS5 though to get rid of all the stupid shit in it. Oh, oops! I oh, no, oh, fuck this. Let's run it back. Give me a damage report. 
Sure, no damage so far, sir, but I'm still checking. I'm showing a hatch breach. We may oh, I drop you somewhere. Oh. I just saw some... That guy's a spy! No, I'm not! I'm not a spy. Who are you lying to? Shut up. Your daddy's a spy. Do I have any Lord of the Rings games? I think I have uh, two of them. I, I have the RPG one. I think I have the Hobbit. And I have, uh, I think, Return of the King. Whatever the one that was made by EA. Don't you run from me, big baby baby! Slow mo! Ugh, he got ghetto rock bottom. What about fighting force? I don't own it. I have no. I take the back. I think I own it on N64. I, I. The thing is, I, I have a really hard time, uh, um, streaming or recording N64 games. Can I climb this or oh, okay? Do I still play Lego games? I do not. Last Lego game I played I think was Lego Batman 2. No, I'm not. I think Lego Batman 2 was the last Lego game I played. Or maybe Lego Jurassic Park. Maybe that game was the last one I played. But um The funny thing is with Lego games. I actually feel like Lego games have gotten a lot more like complicated, so it's like low-key kind of like hard for me to play them. I don't know why. It's like I overthink everything when I play it. I don't know. I always get stuck on them. What about Tomb Raider games? I don't like Tomb Raider. You mean like the old ones? I don't really like the old ones. I think the controls are really frustrating, so I don't really like playing them. And the reboot series, the only one I like out of all of them is just the first one. Shadow of the Tomb Raider was whatever. And we streamed it and nobody really gave a shit. So we didn't play it anymore. I didn't really dig Rise and Shadow. I thought they were kind of boring. Just more of the same shit. Reload. You had to think about it. Ratchet and Clank. Yeah, that's maybe. I wouldn't mind playing Going Commando again. I thought that was a really fun game. It's been a while since I played those. <laughs> the reboots multiplayer? I think that game's multiplayer is pretty funny. Oh, I can't lock on him. How do you Can, do they have thermographic vision? Is that why they're lighting me up? Can it thermally point me where the health is at so I don't die? Yo, peek out. Yeah, Dead Space 1, or, Dead Space 1 2, and 3 are on my list of games I want to replay sometime this year. <laughs> and I want to co-op 3 to make it more bearable, because that game just fucking sucks. Dead Space 3 is an awful video game. I don't suppose we could just talk about this. I guess not. <laughs> Jaws? Dude, I'm gonna die! He's gonna hit me and I'm gonna die, watch. Bop! I'm dead. <laughs> right in the back of the head! Oh, that's some nice checkpoints. That's funny. I guess not. That's it, I'm gonna have to kick your ass. Oh, okay, or not. I tried to be slick and duck under it. Here, let's let's just do this. God damn! 
You like how he just goes, oh, I'm falling towards the electricity. Oh, oh, you got me. Ah! I'm so stupid. Oh. Oh, 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 I gotta fall towards the electricity. God damn it. Oh, shit. Got him. Cable guide him? I heard the DLC was pretty good for that game. I also heard that it had a really bad cliffhanger. Number two. They want to go back and change some of the lore for Dead Space 3? We only did one out of four Bond moments. Mm hmm. Yeah, choking everyone out. <laughs> choking everyone out. Choking everyone out. Choking everyone out. So it's just complete self. We still got a gold. Well. So just you have to completely stealth the, that level. Um, it's funny because we're looking for that. We were, this mission was finding her, and like we didn't find her. Um, guys, can you give me one second? I have to use the bathroom real quick. So, uh, one second. Do you think it'll ever be another Bond game? I doubt it. I don't know. Uh, I think I don't. Who owns the license now? I know Activision makes the games, but does Activision still own it? It comes down to whoever owns the license. And they just need to have... Because, I mean, the last couple Bond games kind of bombed. So I think that's why they stopped making them. They just weren't selling. Um, I'll be right back. I have to use the bathroom. Be right back. Hello, my my brethren. Yeah, white. What what happened to your account, white? Something happened. There's three channel bans and two profile bans. You get in a lot of trouble, dude. What what happened this time? Don't don't give us any names, though. Out of respect, don't don't give us any names on what happened. But what happened? Without saying any names. Uh, have you seen a trailer for Bloodlines 2? I have not. You guys want to watch it on stream? I haven't seen it. You guys down to watch the Bloodlines trailer? I'll watch it. Let me pull it up. <sighs> you're insta banned for your username? God, that's so, people are so soft. Jesus. People are silly. Here we go. The trailer is two minutes long. The wokest game ever, Vampire the Masquerade, Bloodlines. 
Okay, let's watch the trailer together, guys. Let me mute this and minus that down. Okay. Oh shit, I think I have the audio down. Not actual gameplay chat. This city will bleed you dry. You're young. You'll fight over scraps. Safety is bought with blood. Yours. Theirs. I was ex. Yo, she. That looks. Yo, is that what's her name? Um, Christina Hendricks? Is that. Y'all get that vibe, right? Does that look like Christina Hendricks, y'all? That looks just like her. Ours. Make one mistake. And it's over. Here, no one's hands stay clean. Oh shit, that's not cool. I wonder if they'll add any new classes. You will come to Adapt to the it. times, yeah. As much as I do. That sucks. Hopefully it doesn't really affect much of anything. But I've waited so long to see it again. I just know that Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines is like one of the best games I've ever played. Like that was a really, really, really good game. I really liked it a lot. That game was a lot of fun. That looks like a lot of fun. I'm excited. I think it's gonna be great. I just hope that it's as cool as the original. Yeah, you gotta dance to restore humanity and shit. Yeah. This game sound feels a lot lower than it should be. Are there VODs? No, that was before I figured out a way to save the VODs. See, um, Azure, um, what Twitch does is it deletes VODs after uh, 60 days. Um, but a way to get around that is you have to make a highlight of the whole stream in order to save it forever. That's how I was able to save all of the Harry Potter videos. We, I did stream the first Vampire uh, the Masquerade. We streamed it, I think, last summer. Uh, I wouldn't mind playing it again, though. That game was a lot of fun. Maybe we'll play it again when it you know, gets a little bit closer to the date of the game coming out to get hyped for it. And we'll do another class. So. Where's my controller? Yeah, that's so that's what I do now. Like, full playthroughs, I, I actually uh, I save them now i don't record my streams anymore because i, I ran out of room <laughs> i ran out of room on my hard drive and it's easier just to make vods i mean uh turn the vods into uh turn the vods into cl um, highlights and highlights stay forever dr nadanova who are you doctor where you get all that body the general is getting away with the nano robot the general do I have Dino Crisis? I do. I don't like Dino Crisis though. Not a fan. I I heard Dino Crisis 2 is good. I think we may be reaching the end of the line here. But I didn't like the first Dino Crisis. I thought the game was annoying. So. He's like Steve. No, it's Buscemi. Steve Buscemi. Has a Native American cowboy in it. Now you got my attention. Good night, Rose. Oh! Oh! Is Turok on Switch worth playing? There's like OG Turok? Yo, how do I go forward? Here we go. Are you sure about that? Yo, they should explain these controls, my guy. Oh my god. Neofan, welcome to the Stampede. You, you hot mans, you. 
Welcome, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy hanging out with us playing some James Bond or Ruski games. Oh shit! What's the bombs? What's the, use bombs, but what button is bombs? That's the flare. How do I use the bombs? Ah, oh, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Ugh. What the sh- Why is this so hard to control? Ugh. Fucking bombs. Come on. Come on, just hit the- Yeah, fuck this. Restart. Have you ever played the Nier series? I played Nier whatever the f one on PS3 is. I thought it was okay, it was cool. It had really good music, and then I played Nier Automata and I didn't really like it. I thought it was whatever. It had a, the camera was really shitty. And uh, I think it was a combination of the camera not being very good and me just not really being super into it. And then everyone acting like it's like the greatest game ever fucking created. I think that's maybe just not really give a shit. Some flares may help to shake those missiles, 007. At least they tell you this time. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> I, I'd rather just hit those with missiles, dude, because the bombs, like, they don't fucking work. They're so hard to hit people, they ain't worth it. Yeah, fucking big ass, like, big giant thing got place. it. Pretty funny. Bond, do not let that helicopter get away. Yeah, I, I, just, I honestly just wasn't really feeling near all that much. I didn't. I thought the camera was pretty bad, and it was like frustratingly bad. And then, uh, You're a skillful pilot, Mr. um. Bond. I thought 2B was kind of a bitch, so I didn't really like her very much. I, mean, I, just, I just wasn't really feeling it, you know? I didn't really care what was going on. A lot of people said that the story got a lot better later on, which, you know, I believe you, but I just, I just, I guess I just didn't get to that part yet. So, I mean,. I just didn't really like it. The structure is protected by those shield generators. You'll need to deal with them before continuing on with your mission. We got one. The shield is weakening. Yeah, I mean it's it's worth checking out. I just didn't really The game has really good music. The music in it is fantastic. I just wasn't really feeling it, honestly. It was okay. Yo, dog, my missiles are going through. Oh, I'm out of bullets. Okay. Get these bombs. Drop the bombs on them. Yeah, 2B did have a lot of butt. What did 2B stand for? Two butt cheeks? You saved my life. How can I ever repay you? Allow me to take you to dinner. Next time in London. I'd like that. But until then... Oh no, no! I can't believe this. Take that. As a small down... Can't believe this. Thanks for saving me. Mm. Let me... He gonna call her up. Put your coochie on the phone. He's got cooties now, it's over. 
I did do a player though. Successful. All of the nanobots were destroyed. Except for one. My gift to you. There's a she has pockets. Subscriber. James Bond. Bond. Are you what sure a, about that? What a con. Yo, White, welcome back, man. You know Account okay. number three, right? My mentor, my teacher, my she has a lab coat on. There's pockets. Bond has now planted the seeds for his own destruction. Soon enough. His the pockets are good enough. In fear, the name Nikolai Diablo. You'll have everything Give him cooties. Give him yes, cooties. Katya. Everything or nothing. Yeah. Cooties. Yeah. This is a Greek goblin. Don't tell Harry. His blue pocket. Jaws still alive? Okay, sure. That was a little extreme. Uncensored. Oh boy. The Native American dude named Dave. The Nanobots. We only we got two out of three. The Spider Explorer. Our new field reconnaissance device. You're the first agent to use it, so do <laughs> He yeah. said, Paul Wall. <laughs> you know how many 007 movies I've watched? Uh, I've seen every one of them after GoldenEye. I can honestly say, I think before GoldenEye, the only movie that I've seen was maybe Goldfinger. We've added a strobe function to the coin grenades. The flash will stun anyone who sees it. Use this if you My favorite is probably Goldeneye. Either Goldeneye or The World Is Not Enough. One of those two. And then, uh, because I grew up watching those, and those are those are ones I could just watch on loop, like, all the time. I can watch it all the time. Especially, uh, World Is Not Enough. That was, like, my perfect study movie. Because that movie had, like, the perfect amount of, like, boring in action. It gave me enough time to, like, work on papers or study. And then watch the cut, you know, some cool shit, and then go back to work. But, um... Um, I think out of the newer ones, my favorite is probably Casino Royale. Inspector is pretty good too. So you make it a cow here than puns? Yeah, and Goldeneye has Zenya on the top. The standard issue dart gun carries a fast action here, you, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna show you guys why that, uh, that, uh, it's tomorrow, by, not tomorrow never dies, uh, die another day is bad. Yeah, let me, let me show you why that movie is not very good. Let me find it. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> this shit is so fucking stupid. This shit is awful. Hold on. Let me pull it up. Look at this, man. This shit is dumb. Time to draw the line. So okay, so 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 look what's look what's happening. Look at this. This shit is stupid. Okay, we don't we don't need all this. We need we need to get to the good. There we go. <laughs> I remember seeing this in theaters going, what the fuck is this? I was like, I like, I like leaned over to my dad and I was like, Dad, I, I, I think this movie's gonna be bad. Like, we were like watching this shit. Oh, man. Ugh. That's like the one part I remember, just this part, and then the part when Halle Berry comes out of the water with all that body. Those are the only parts I remember of that movie. And I guess when she beats up that bony white chick. Magnificent view. It is, isn't it? 
Too bad it's lost on everybody else. <laughs> he said, Pierce, just act like you're on a, riding a surfing a tsunami with a parachute. He's like, okay. You should try it. Yeah, let me see if I can find that, that the scene when they're like fighting. Let me find Jacinta it. Johnson. My friends call me Jinx. I got you, Jinx. This fucking laser fight? Oh yeah, this shit. My my, you get around. Let's go to the point. Start fight. Fight, beat beat him up. Beat her up. Get her, Halle Berry, get her! Oh my god. Undercover brother? No, it isn't, no. It's a different woman. That is some good attire, though, right? That's some good fighting attire. You know, that's exactly what I wear when I get in sword fights. I gotta make sure that all the skin's exposed, so if you cut me, you cut me good. He said there's a two-inch joke in this scene? I think so. Damn, I've been flipping all over the place. <gasps> no! No, she said a bad word. No! How could you? How could you, Halle Berry? How could you? She was so young and beautiful. What? Really? That's how that scene ends? Oh no, it was cut. Looks like we're going down together. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 now, whoa. Wait a minute. Now, whoa. That's funny. Oh, man. How could you? The two-inch scene? I don't know. I, I can just, I'll just Google it. I don't know what happens in that scene. I don't remember it. Is it like the end or whatever when they're like hugged up? Yeah, I don't know. Professional surfer. You got James Bond look like Jesus. My usual sweet please. Do you have a credit card? Or any luggage? Mr. Bond, so good to see you. Yeah, that's funny. Any triple X with Vin Diesel escaping that avalanche? Probably. For no, no for me. See you, players. Up. We've upgraded the Cayenne with a cloaking device, 007, which will make you temporarily invisible to your enemies. It has a limited battery life, though, so use it sparingly. Your Cayenne has now been outfitted with a remote control device, 007. It can be deployed to scout ahead, and the onboard laser can be used to help you access hard to reach areas. Uh, oh. Okay. The cayenne with the pepper. Damn, M looking old as fuck. Is that the Joker? She's a really, really big mouth. Double O Seven, welcome back. Nice to see you again, Em. Excellent work rescuing Doctor Nadanova, Double O Seven. However, we have a new crisis on our hands. We've lost contact with Double O Three. He was in Peru investigating Nikolai Diavolo, a KGB agent so ruthless that the KGB itself tried to have him terminated. Unfortunately, they failed. Diavolo's control, his teacher, was Max Zorin. Yes, we once played bridge together. He lost. We believe 003's life may be in danger. 
I'm on my way to Peru. And don't forget to stop by Q Branch on your way out. Good morning, Q. Ah, 007, we have some new equipment for you. Have you met my new assistant, Miss Nagai? I don't believe I've had the pleasure. And you won't, if I have any say in the matter. Now, pay attention, 007. This is your remote control spider cam. You can use it to scout ahead. A spy disguised as a spider? Frightening. Hey, did you guys hear that Ultraviolet is shutting down July 31st? And I'm low-key kind of glad because I fucking hate Ultraviolet. Because it never worked. This is your new dart gun. It knocks your enemies out instead of killing them. How thoughtful. Now, 007, do try what do you think of Sekiro so far? I I like it a lot. I think it's a lot of fun. Do my best. Um, I, I don't like of. how the game has like this mentality of like it has to mob you. That isn't very fun. That's probably the worst part of the game. The fact that like oh here's a boss or a mini boss. Oh wait, he's got nine goons with you that are gonna get a, that are gonna just gang bang you the whole time. That part sucks. If there was a lot less of that, it'd be a lot more enjoyable. Uh, Ultraviolet is a, 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 a website that you can digitally buy movies from. Most company, a lot of companies used Ultraviolet to give, uh, um, to give, uh, um, here, let's turn this. This game is really quiet. To give the rider the ability to lay the bike flat, thereby avoiding any low hanging obstacles. Uh, it was uh, a way to I get digital to movies. So, like, if you bought like a movie, it would come with a code 007. that you'd have to use on Ultraviolet. I mean it. Yeah, they're shutting down July 31st. Did I buy anything from Epic Games? Nah. I don't ever plan on getting the Epic Games launcher. Why is it shutting down? I don't know. I never said it. I just got an email about it. Sekiro, instead of like a Souls game, feels more like a modern day, tough, Tenchu game than it does Souls. Yeah, I, I don't. I, I I don't really. I don't want another launcher. This was just a cutscene. I don't want another launcher on my computer. I'm not going to use the Epic Game Store until I have to. You know what I mean? Like, I don't have anything against it. I just... I don't need it. There's nothing on it that I... You know what I mean? She may have an idea of his I don't really need it. Check in Once they have a game on it that, like, I want to play and I have no choice, then I'll get it. Now the game is hella loud, dude. What the fuck? I have not got to the Genshiro fight yet. Unless I don't know who he is. Yeah, like the voice is low and then all the gun shit. You must not let that henchman report your yeah, position. look, and now it's fucking quiet again. What the fuck? Can I... Yeah, let's do... Oh. Drop this to like... 80? You can actually hear? That's why we have subtitles on. Find a way to stop him. Oh no, that makes things even fucking worse. I'll just turn my recorder up. Psychic Stage Gym is controlling a storm, but no, I have not fought that guy. I think Genshiro is a dude that he has like a sword and like a big bow and arrow on his back or something like that. I haven't fought him yet. I can't remember the last boss I fought. Um. Hmm. The last boss I fought was, um, what was it? Some dude in, like, the Ashina Tower, he, like, he wears, like, blue, and he, when he attacks, he, like, attacks, like, he hits, like, three or four times really hard, and he does mad chip damage. I remember that was, like, one of the, it's in, like, the, one of the beginning towers. Yo, I can, we're hauling so much ass, man. This shit was driving slow before. Is there? Yo, oh, there isn't. Oh, fuck me, right? Trigger man, what up, dude? How you doing?
do I should have picked up these kids from school, right? Oops, that did a lot of damage. Imagine Bond walking in there. You're running inside the of my house. Subscriber. No, that wasn't me. That was, that was my twin. And who you, sure you welcome that? back, dude? That Gex, right? Yes? Jack? Thank God. It's Serena. I was so Oh, Headless, the dude that slows you down? I saw him once and he right. killed me and then I just went somewhere else because I didn't want to deal with that shit. They're not who they seem to be. I was like, this is annoying and I left. Is anyone? That's that, like, headless, like, goon dude that, like, you, when you're by him, you slow down. That shit was ass, so I just left. I was, this is stupid. That Serena's line at the hotel was tapped. She is in grave danger. It's imperative you get there as quickly as you can. We gotta save. Oh, fuck. We gotta save. Her. The Battlefield BR? That, has that, that came out? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, shit. Came out today. Okay, is it any good? I know blackout's a lot of fun. The local patrols. Avoidance is the best policy here. Keep your weapons disengaged. Really? Oh. oh okay. Announce the new Shantae game. Yeah, I heard Shantae five. Uh, hello. Seven, you are not advised to engage the local patrols. Avoidance is the best policy here. Keep your weapons disengaged. How do you disengage weapons? Do I just like... There's no... How, can I look at my map? That's like the only way forward. You can't crash through that. Yeah, I thought maybe I hit it at the wrong angle. The cloaking thing, but yeah, but how do you get around, though? Oh, there you go. That's how you get to the map. Uh, we can go all the way around. Nice. Yeah, but that's the thing about the cloaking thing, is if I were the clone, cloak, how would I get past them? GPS map has been modified to call out local patrols, 007. Do your best to stay out of their way. We shall try. It's like Metal Gear Solid, okay. How do you do the cloak thing? I don't know how to select it. I know we did just get a cloak, but... Like, how do we use it? What is that lady doing just running in circles in the street? Look! What the fuck? Well... Did I lose it? Nope. Did <laughs> somebody crash and blow up by? Oh, the nice. Yo, GB Sports, what up, dude? Can we lose them by just blowing them up? Fuck it, I'm gonna just blow them up. Really? Step out of the vehicle and keep your hands in the air. Why the fuck did the missiles fly over the car that's right in front of me? <sighs> okay. Why? 
Uh, okay. There's always that one shitty driving mission. Cayenne's GPS map has been modified to call out local patrols, 007. Do your best to stay out of their way. How do they know it's me? Oh, only 007 drives that that SUV. He's a dad on the edge. You can hear them crashing in the shit. Fuck me, man. Nice. Bond, you'll need to lose that tail if you're to meet up with Miss Saint Germain. Oh, what? Whoop. Whoop. Can't go that way. Step out of the vehicle. I think it's pretty cool how they put like a little image over the window to make it look like you're driving like the reflection of the cars. That's a really cool touch, even though it's like super hell inaccurate. But that's like a cool little detail. See, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna wait for it to go by. I don't think we're gonna make it because it's gonna go around. No, we might, we might. Fuck yeah, okay. Then we just drove right into another patrol. Nope, it drove right past me, nice. Find a way past that roadblock. Perhaps one of Q's gadgets can help you create a distraction. You <laughs> just fucking crashing and shit? Where even is this like fucking area where we gotta blow up the stuff? I'm just afraid to go anywhere because I don't want to get. See, I don't want that shit to happen. Bond, you'll need to lose that tail if you're to meet up with Miss Saint Germain. All right, I'm gonna drive around and look for the thing I'm supposed to actually. Where is? Where is it? Oh, I lost him. Don't forget, 007, you're Wow. Make okay. Visible for a short time only. Yo, where, where the fuck? Where's the building? Yeah, excited. Yeah. Do, you, do any of you guys see this fireworks shop? I don't see it. Is it right here? Oh, it's over here, okay. Make 
contact with the I died, man. You've lost our own lead. Oops. This is confusing. The navigation device sucks penis, Am. The Cayenne's GPS map has been modified to call out local patrols, 007. Do your best to stay out of their way. So we have to, I guess, at the last moment I saw that we had to get the, the blue thing. Forget 007, your Q cloak will make you invisible for a short time only. You need to find a way past that roadblock. Perhaps one of Q's gadgets can help you create a distraction. Okay. It's like, oh, go look there, kaboom. Kabo Get our okay. We're going in, boys. Hey, magical card. Magical cat, my bad, I can't read. It's a little tough. Boom. Well done, W7. Now get up that hill and rendezvous. Am I sipping on? I got water. That's about it. Oh shit. Yeah, they don't care anymore. It's kind of funny, isn't it? Somebody blew up the fireworks station. We need our fireworks. Oh, you know what game comes out really soon that I'm excited and I pre-ordered? Tropico 6. Doesn't that come out tomorrow? Oh my god, more of this bullshit. That was annoying. The 28th? I thought it was the 26th. Oh, it's the 29th. What's that, the Friday? Serena Saint Damn! Serena. Damn! What you were, what you, what you, what you, what you, what, 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 what? Jack? So that was Oh, you that's homegirl. Do you know where he is? He went off to investigate some platinum I discovered near a fortress outside of town. That's the last I saw of him. I stay for a drive. Why don't you show me the way? Poly po polygon? Yeah. All the police here answer Oops. to Diavolo. He controls everything in this town. Right here. Oh, do I really have to? They said avoid the patrol, just blowing motherfuckers up. I stopped giving a fuck ten minutes ago. Go left here. Started tearing up, blew up. I 
I've seen enough 90s romantic comedies to know where this is going. Suckers. You hear that? You hear a noise? <laughs> a whole ass car. Uh oh. A whole ass car drove by? Look out! Uh oh. Damn. Be a lift, 007. It's your only chance. Hold on. Hold on. Look at them frames, bro. They did it for epicness. Even did the bounce. That was so ghetto. Why is she not like, ah! Like, I'd be fucking screaming, dude, if this was going on. Uh-oh. Come on, use that horsepower for the, for the dads all around the world, Bond. You won't be able to drive up to the front gate, 007. Look for an alternate route to get in. Just bust through all slow. That's funny. That's pretty funny. Oh boy. What was the other? Probably having to get through without getting caught. Whatever. Helicopter weapon upgrade? Sure, we'll save. It's the Cayenne Turbo. We got the one where they put the pepper in the engine. Get Vertigo? You ever seen a movie Vertigo that mean anything to you? Anybody download that Epic Games launcher? I heard it'd be stealing your info. And Stay shit back. like that. What are we gonna do? You're gonna take cover near those tanks. And you? Isn't it funny how like in this day and age, announcing that your game is coming to Steam is like, what the fuck? Is like a big, huge thing. You know how people mind. went buck ass wild when they announced that the Master Chief Collection was coming to, coming to Steam. People lost their fucking melons. Bond, by hacking into their computer system, we have reason to believe 003 might be imprisoned somewhere atop that cliff. Hurry, 007. You're our only hope. And My only one noticed that when Bond moves around, it's like controlling. <laughs> It's like controlling Batman, he just, he just he just never turns his neck. C cries in Microsoft. You stay where you are. Okay. That's Bond. No, it ain't. No, let me run, let me run it back. Let me run it back. He said, "Das him. Das the gonna guy." Do? You're gonna take cover near those tanks. And you? What about the guards? Work night. I don't think they'll mind. Yeah, we already have enough launches on our computers, honestly. Like, do I have my uh, yeah, sleeper dart? You know what I mean? I, I I'll I don't have anything against the epic launcher. I just don't want another launcher, and I will get it when I don't have a choice. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Kung Fu! Kung Fu is ass! Oh! I just saw something. 
You didn't see shit. I have a question for you guys. I want your guys' opinion on something, on how you view something. I saw a couple of people arguing on Twitter about this, and I didn't really get it. Like, people were, of course, you know, people always argue, but let me get your guys' opinion on something. So, someone said that, someone said that Epic Games buying all of these exclusives is making competition for Steam, correct? But then someone said it's not competition when they don't have the same games. Does it? That doesn't make any sense. Because like the per, I know what the person was saying. They meant like competition as in another launcher. But the person said, how can there be competition when they don't have the same game? So one person was saying like, they can't like for example with Metro, they can't be in competition with them because they have Metro, so they can't sell Metro. Is what the guy was saying. like the, the guy was like trying to argue back even though he was and then like they the funny thing is someone gave him an example saying like that's like saying like two grocery stores don't sell the same type of grocery i mean the same groceries but they're still in competition with each other because they're still grocery stores and like they were like no there's no competition it's not a competition when you buy it. there was a lot of people that were like that too they were saying that if epic games buy certain games exclusive to them then that means there's no competition because they're buying it and you can't compete because you don't have the same game. Yeah. So they were like arguing. It was a lot of people arguing about that. It was like, it's not a competition because they don't have the same games. And he was like, it doesn't matter if they have the same games. Like, I don't know. They were just like, I just want to know what your guys' opinion on it. Who's there? Oh, fuck. They done found me. Oh, why'd I go out of cover? You sizing me up? You dead. You like how he reloads just by touching it? Doesn't even pull the thing out. Is it competition both in launches of Whole Foods still competing with Walmart since they're both supermarkets? Yeah, that's what, I, that's what people were saying. There were just a lot of people that were saying that it's not considered competition because they don't sell the same games. Because they think like, oh, Metroid Exodus, Steam can't compete with Metro Exodus sales because Epic Games Launcher is the only launcher that has it right now, so they can't compete. But the whole the point is they're competing as a store, not on the specific items. But that's what like people were saying. They were Disable like, "Oh, the hoist controls. I'm gonna have to get up there another way." Yeah, it was Correct, people are fucking stupid. Look for an old junction box. It's part of the mine's original wiring structure, hidden somewhere in the cliffs. Oh, what the? F Where the fuck did that guy come from? He just fell from the ceiling. Yeah, like, low-key, if you ever see, like, a bunch of people, like, if you ever see a Epic Games, like, launcher exclusive announcement, whoa. Just read the comments, man. It is full of the stupidest fucking people. It's ridiculous. Oh, he actually hit the thing. That's cool. Your aim's getting better. Oh, never mind. It's getting worse. <laughs> You got me down. He said, Don't. Oh, oh, shit. Hey, dog, you cheating. Couldn't even lock on you, bitch.
Isn't it funny how like rocket launchers do like baby shit damage, but like you get shot with a with a regular ass machine gun and there oh there goes your health. Yeah, like with with Metroid Exodus, um I don't mind just getting it on console or waiting until it goes to Steam. Because it's not a game that I was like hella excited for. Because I also heard from a lot of people that, that new uh, Obsidian like Fallout style game is uh gonna be exclusive to Epic Games and a lot of people were so Super pissed about that. Now you better run, bitch. A lot of people are really mad about that. Like, if you go through the comments when they announce that, people are like, well, like, thanks for letting me know what game I'm not buying. They're running out of money? No, man. They have, they have Fortnite. They're never going to run out of money. I think there's just a lot of people are just, just angry about it, you know? We'll be playing all of the... James Bond games? We're gonna play a bunch of them. I don't know if all of them, though. I don't own all of them. I'd have to find them. What? I wasn't even aiming at him. Oh, okay. You can get on the Windows Store? Yeah, because I want to do that. Do people actually buy shit from the window store? <laughs> That's like one of the worst experiences I've ever had in my life, the window store. I never want to buy anything from the window store ever again. That shit was bad. The window store is... Having it on the window store is just like, just not having it all. That shit's awful. Bond, you're running out of time. You must find that uplink device and install it so we can help you find 003. If 003 wasn't fucking up, then we wouldn't have to do all this bullshit. Yeah, people just really hate the Epic Games launcher. I don't, I don't know why. I honestly just don't want another launcher. But if it came down to it, if there was a game I really wanted to play, I would just download it and buy it. But until then... Are these guys wearing bulletproof... Wife beaters? I think they were wearing bulletproof wife beaters. Yeah, they were. Huh. Reload. Oh, boy. You said this was better on Game Boy? I've never played it. Well, what is it like on Game Boy? Like Game Boy Advance? I've only ever played uh, the GameCube version, because it's the one I own. Oh lord, that's not cool. His uplink device, oh, there it is, I think that's it. M, I've found 003's uplink, but not 003. Hey, Halo. MCR, how's the, uh, have you been playing, uh, Phone Destroyer? I keep getting put out of clans because I don't play that often. Because <laughs> I, I only play, like, once a day or once every other day, and that's not good enough for some folks. So I just get put out a lot. Oh! U-Torn is the best launcher. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Now we gotta protect it. Good job, Bob. <laughs> Just one guy tried to stop it? <laughs> I don't even remember where the elevator is, man. Just, I guess down there? Dude down there. Oh, I remember now. That was way back here. You hear all this creaky ass shit? Sounds like somebody's just farting all over the place. Ow. Is it back that way or is it this way? This is the perfect opportunity to use your 
thermographic vision. Okay. Ever played Mass Effect? Yeah, I played the first one. And I, I got, like, almost through the second one. Um, I never played the third one. I heard it was pretty good, but I also heard the ending was shit. How do I turn this off? Just a hole in the floor. What's the what was the purpose of coming down here? There was no purpose. Just had I think it maxed out my MP5K ammo. I guess. Hold up. He's waiting up there to kick my ass? Alright, I'll give it to you then. I'll be a gentleman. I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Come here! Ah! Uh. Oh my god, I'm getting lit up! We're risking it to get that bisque. Yeah, we're dead. I didn't know he went that far out the blind fire. That's crazy. Stay back. What are we gonna do? You're gonna take cover near those tanks. And you? What about the guards? I don't think they'll mind. Yeah, you gotta play the whole. The majority of the levels aren't very long. They just make you do it again, I guess. I don't know. We're not gonna silence. We're not gonna. We're not gonna put guards to sleep, man. We're gonna pull them. Put them to sleep forever. I'm doing it. I just saw something. No, you didn't. The forever nap. I'm gonna give him the forever now. Well, I don't even think I even hit him. The checkpoint system is ass. You know what's ass about it? The fact that it just doesn't exist. <laughs> there is no checkpoint. You gotta. Oh, fuck! There is no checkpoint system. You just gotta replay the whole level. Well, I guess there technically was a checkpoint in that one when we got killed by Jaws. So that guy fucking action Jackson dive out through that window? Okay, now we gotta... Now we're getting loud and sloppy. So let's uh, pull out the AK with the 13 bullets. Oh! Oh! Shameful display. Is that going on when Orange did this because they own Battlefield? Why didn't anyone flip it when Origin did this? I think it's because people are already used to it, but the, I think people are upset at the fact that they're just throwing their money around. Yeah, and that's another thing too. Origin's exclusive for games they made themselves, so you don't really have a choice. I think it's just the fact that Epic is buying up like these exclusives because they can, I guess. I don't know. I think that's what people are mad about. Because if you want an EA game, you gotta kinda buy it through Origin. I have to sneeze really bad again. Okay, we're back. My bad. Oh, fucking me up, man.
the leaked PS5 controller? Is there? That's probably not even real. Nice. I'm sitting here trying to crouch, and he's just gonna go on the wall. Ooh, whiz right by my head. Bond, what are you? What the fuck are you doing, dude? Is he really shooting? He's really shooting. Oh my god, Jesus. You said he was shooting the thing. <laughs> Come on, man. We found the rocket launcher, though. Jack 2 is a pretty frustrating game, honestly. I remember that game being really fucking annoying. And, like, not very fun. Yeah, Bond tanking on full-ass rockets, but, like, put a couple of bullets in his ass, and he just folds like a goddamn house of cards. People are... people are... people are petty. This is unfair. Just, just, like, come on, man. No, come on. Lock on the, the, there we go. Straight up just miss? Hey, you wait your turn. Double seven, your spider drone may be able to access that area. Look for an opening nearby. So I don't fucking die before that happens. Spider drone time, you guys ready? Where the opening is. Claims there's some kind of opening nearby, but. I, was ex I would expect it to be close. Hmm. Let's, let's keep going. Let's see what we can find. Okay, well, there isn't many places I can go. Crawl up the guard's ass. See, I can't, I can't look, a, really look around. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Pick me up. Can I just shoot the glass? Can I walk on walls? I don't think so. But I'm like looking around to see if there's any holes in the walls. I don't think it can climb on walls. Hmm. 
And he said, look for an opening nearby. And we pretty much searched. I thought maybe there was like a vent of this dude. You're running out of time. You must find that uplink device and install it. So Shut we can up. help you find 003. Shut up. You're doing through with the red panel? We have to find the uh the uh thing that she was just bitching at me about, and then you stick it on that panel and it turns on the power. Not even my bond vision is showing us what's around here. You gotta push something or shoot something? Maybe. So the thing is, usually what you can shoot, when you go into this bond vision, it glows. Like, stuff that's important. Um, but, I don't know. Unless it's outside of this room. I hear the, the the eagles. Yeah, whatever. We can't find it. Yeah, I, I remember where the device is. It's just where am I getting shot at? No, the thing is, is uh, uh, when I went by this door, Q was like, "Oh, use your spider drone to get in that room and all this shit," and like, but there's no. I see that there's a vent right there, but that's a big ass vent. Like, you see how big that vent is right there? So, that means there's got to be an equally sized vent somewhere around here that'll get that door open. But, I don't know. Somewhere around here. Just to understand where. He fucking, he's shooting at me? The moment I see him and aim at him, he runs away. Yeah, I don't know. That boy ran away really quick. We got the armor. If it's higher up in the stage, I'll look for it. It's just they should have. The game was like talking like it was right there. Oh, 007, there's a booty hole sized hole. So you need to put your tongue in. And that's how you unlock the next level. Whoa. I should have just, there was like health, yeah, there was health right there to the left, too. God damn it. I like how it just straight up just goes, Dah! cutsy. Did you hear something? Hey, you. Hey, you. Yo, what? There's not normally three goons down. Oh, because I guess I got caught. They just magically spawn dudes. Kofi versus Brian? Really? They spoiled that? Where'd they spoil it at? It's probably on Reddit or something else. Someone posted on Reddit. Reddit is where all the juicy, the juicy shit comes out. Oh, it was on an ad? So they fucked it up? That guy blended in really good with the wall.
We're gonna leave the health there. Oh! We're gonna get the health. How much health do we have? Oh, we're full. Never mind. Oh, we're gonna get the health. I think we broke the thing. It's still squeaking. Like we're pushing it. Did you want super card? supposed to use that rocket for except for blowing up the satellite dish do you think that's where the hole is he oh you, you, do you think so down here you think it's that hole the thing is I don't think we can go in there yeah I don't know I don't really see anything standing out. It's completely dark. Oh, before you go down. Okay, I'll go look. I mean, in there? I'll give it a shot. Let me just look around. All right, let's let's try it out. Oh yeah, there you go. Bingo. I was about to say I thought it was on a complete it's on the upper floor, but it make you okay. That's cool. I just think it's bullshit that when you actually find it it's like, oh, look for a space nearby. This isn't nearby. This is on another floor. Yo, look at all that. You can pick up you can pick up health, but you can't pick up bullets. Fuck you! Oh yeah, I was having a problem with Twitch earlier today. Um, hello? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, streams aren't showing for people, okay. I know, I was having a problem watching someone earlier where, uh, their stream just ca I just kept getting an error message saying like, Oh, the Twitch thing has been unplugged, you know, that bullshit. You motherfucker punched me in the- <laughs> slapping- Yo, where'd the armor? Just put your bullets, put your put your fingers in my mouth, huh? Fuck yeah! Now we're packing, broski.
the fuck? Oh, is it the one guy? It's the guy again! The one that runs! That's not... Yo, can you hear it? Every time I shoot, you can hear someone go, Ooh! Oh! Wow, what the fuck? There was a guy in the building! I mean, in the... In the what the fuck? Divine Catharsis. Oh, yeah! What up, man? You're not having a good day? Why just you make you giggle? Oh, man. Hopefully your day gets a little bit better. We're playing some Ghetto Bond games. I got an idea. I got a plan. Hopefully it doesn't kill me. It probably will, but at least it'll be funny. You guys ready? Oh, this is not the right area. My bad. Never mind. Reverse plan. I thought this was the area where you get the uh, the machine. Like the thing you're supposed to get. Oh, it's right there. I wanted to just, cause they're all, there's like four goons there and I just want to shoot one rocket and just kill all of them. So April 6th, it's all good, dude. Hello? You guys ready? <laughs> They were like, wait a minute, we- oh! No one died! Only one guy died. That looks like a bong. Uplink my ass. So you said you see, you just learned that a girl in school you used to be you used to be with got married and had a baby with a main person used to bully you constantly. You know what you should do? You should kick his ass and tell him his baby's ugly. No, I'm kidding. But kick his ass. It's not the baby's fault he's ugly. <laughs> I'ma fuck you up, don't you come over here. He's coming! <laughs> oh yeah, he's gonna get revenge by bullying his baby. <laughs> he imagine just looking at like an innocent, like just nine month year old, and just looking at him going, "Damn you, ugly! You an ugly baby. Your daddy sucks, and you're ugly." Baby just sitting there shitting on himself, don't know what's going on. Steal his baby's candy. <laughs> He's like, <"Bull> <laughs> that's fucked up. Who said that? Somebody, somebody was like, you should get revenge by bullying his baby. <laughs> yeah, look at him. You can't even talk. You can't even use a toilet, baby. Who's the who, who's the bitch now? You be boo booing on yourself. Can't even talk. Anything about Arizona? I just know it's hot. You talking about the iced tea? Or like the actual place, Arizona? I just know it's really hot there. I, that's all I know. And I always get Arizona mixed up with Nevada. I know no problem, Ty. That's pretty funny though. Somebody was like, you should get revenge by bullying his baby. <laughs> uh. Sneak into his house. He said, "Sneak into his house and just, and just fart under the blankets. Blame the baby." Ooh, where you come? This auto aim is killer. Oh wait, there we go. Okay, auto aim is killer. I almost died. Well, not really. I took a few bullets. Yeah, give him a wedgie and then shit in his diaper <laughs> and blame it on him. 
forward and onward, 007. I had a feeling w this was the end of the level. It just took us so bones. long to get there. Oh, that's funny. This fucking game. So we did that. We did. We found the thing. Oh. Wait, what? What is this? It has something to do with the explosives. You have to blow some shit up. And then, I guess, stealth the beginning of the level is like... Stealth the whole level or some shit. I gotta use the bathroom again, guys. I drank two bottles of water and I have to pee like crazy, so... Give me one second. I'm gonna just mute the mic. I right, that's not the right button. Oh, gas tank at the bottom? The one has gas tank on the bottom. I didn't see it. I guess we'll know when to come back. All right, I'll be right back. Beth. God damn, I saw it right before I left. Fucking G-Force. Oh, and then it went away. Son of a bitch. I'm trying to pee! Come on! We're back. We're getting nothing but golds, my guy. I hate how when you want to save, you go click save, hit hit load the load the save, then you pick the save, then you, you that put the name again, and then you gotta override file and press the A button, and then it's gotta save. We got a gold on that one. We died so many fucking times. Whatever. We're on the ruined tower, and the next we're gonna fight some Willem Dafoe. I'm excited, Ruskied. Oh shit! No cutscene. Okay. We got a sweat fest. So we got my sleeper dart. I don't need it. Oh, wait! Hold on! 
on, wait. Let me get my my sleeper dart out. Wait, the sleeper dart looks like the. What the fuck? What is going on? What the shit? He said, "What's that?" Came all the way over to me. Intruder. The guy got put to sleep, and I got a double seven. <laughs> Infiltrate in us. We're blending in really we wore the right suit. We're blending in Can Willem Dafoe be the friend defeat the friend? Shoot you fuck Why you take so long? You only get a lot of ammo in this game Intruder! Start spitting on him. You guys hear the bongos? I need to record Devil May Cry tonight or Resident Evil. What do you guys think? Maybe I'll just do Resident Evil, get it over with. Like the, because I, the reason why I've just been kind of bullshitting on Resident Evil is because I don't want to play that DLC. I really don't. I don't like it. What the fuck? Out of nowhere. There's a lot of stuff left to do in the remake. I still have Leon B and Claire A. And uh, I have two more of those DLCs, but I just don't want to play that shit. I don't like the DLC. I think the DLC is ass. I kill him? What? Oh, they had to zoom in? He's dead. Yeah, that's why I've just been delaying it. I really don't want to play it. I don't, I don't, the only one I like is Kendo. I don't like the other ones at all. They're not very fun. I just don't want to do it. And plus, we just got the Dante in DMC, too, so. Dante's a lot of fun. Pretty good. I just It just sucks that they make you listen to his song at least once. I'd, I'd rather just not, you know? Well, fuck me, huh? Sitting here thinking that you're just supposed to shoot this down. Wouldn't you assume you have to shoot this down? Well, I still don't like it. I don't like listening to it. I'll gladly pass. I think when I played through when I played through DMC5 on Xbox, I think when I played as Dante, I just because I don't think I had access to the music changes yet because the, the game wasn't out yet. I think at that point I just would just turn the game audio all the way down. I think the music I just turned it off. Oh fuck! Where was that guy I killed? That. At the rocket launcher. He was up there, wasn't he? Oh no. There's a big wall of text. The wall, it's here. No. Oh, shit. There we go. Is it like light in the fire nation yeah, attacking? Hold. Light it up. Hey, Brooke. You got, you, got, you got the whole wall going? How are you? What were you playing? What were you doing today? We're playing some James Bond. Because I missed. Oh my god. It's 
spend some time. You guys, she was, she was playing Catherine. Really? How are you liking Catherine? I remember playing that a long time ago. Did the remaster come out already? The one that people are fussing about the whole... Oops. Something about it. I don't know. It was silly. You guys should definitely check out Brooke. She's so she's so much fun. Unbelievable. I, I cannot believe this. Oh, the Marines out in Japan right now. Joss playing for the playing blind for the first time. I know. Ooh, ooh. I know the the uh, the puzzle the puzzle app part when you're like pushing the blocks around. That takes a little bit to get used to, but once you do, you you get pretty good at it. Did it get censored? I don't think so. I think we already talked about like what they. A lot of people were like super mad about the Japanese version of it. It's really stupid. Yeah, but people are no, you know people get offended about everything. So I don't know if they're gonna. I don't know if they're gonna uh, do anything about it. But whatever. I would probably wasn't gonna buy it anyway. Cause I already own it. And there wasn't really any content I wanted to jump back on. It's dark as shit up in here. Oh, we got a sniper rifle. That means we're gonna do some damage. Oh shit! Yo, where'd that come from? Can y'all see where that missile's coming from? Do it again. Do it again. Ah, oh, there he is. I think that's him right there, right? No, that's another regular goon. Oh, I think I see it. Oh, well, fuck me. Look, he's like, yeah! Take that, Chode. There's one more guy. I believe that is everybody, right? Looks like it. Sweet sniper elite. Sniper eat. I remember Chrono told me a story about he he went to his like local like area to like rent stuff, and it was pretty funny because the he was like he was talking about how the the girl there that was working when he when he was returning Sniper Elite, she was like, oh, how did you like Sniper Elite? And he was like, wait, what? <laughs> Oh, you know, Sniper Elite. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is a Sniper Elite. Peekaboo. I see you. The real question is, but why? Okay, look, this is dynamite. Convenient dynamite. Convenient dynamite. Dynamite. Sniper E. coli? Oh, hi. I was trying to I was trying to counter him, but he was he put his bullets on me. I was gonna counter, I was like, Kia! <laughs> he said, is that a rule? 
Oh shit! Damn, we need, I don't think we only got the one, right? Damn, there was four? We only got one out of four? Oh, a spider one? Yeah, who gives a shit? I guess we did find the sniper rifle. I guess there was another sniper rifle sitting on the table somewhere, I guess. Stealthin' dudes. Stealthin' ones are just cheats, because the stealth in this game is kind of busted. We only got a bronze that game, though. Bust that nut. Bust that thick nut. Death of an agent, Willem Dafoe is so mad. Willem Dafoe is angry. You've come on a fool's errand, 003. Sometimes I think MI6 assigns your numbers based There's on your There's a brand new IQ. subscriber. D-Boy? Are you sure about that? Welcome, D-Boy. I know a this is your first yours. time here. You'll How you doing? You'll have to do better than that. <laughs> it's bulletproof. <clears throat> Enjoy a slow but inevitable death, 003. Do I have to do all the dirty work? Get him! Damn. Fire! Damn, he's still Well, that didn't work out as planned, did it? Will you narrate my life? Damn. Fuck it, why not? Oh shit! Why is it making noise like? R.I.P. Spider, homie. Hiller. Rest in pepperoni, spider homie. Yo, high fives all around, boys. Slap hands, slap hands. Where's 006? Getting for England, James, somewhere? Three whole ass Desert Eagle out? James, you must get to New Orleans. Stop Diavolo before he... <laughs> Damn. Reach 003. He's dead. Hey, you got health down here? You dead ass? Oh! I think he had a shotgun on him. No, he didn't. No. Wow, he socked the. Why wow, it flew in the air? What the fuck? Was that guy Superman? They cheat. They got super soldiers. Papi, papi. Silencio, mijo. Hey. I always have a pronounced I've hard time. Is that? Is Maya and Cheese? I forgot an S. There's my my Maya son. And I can't read. Welcome back. This is the good old Streakarooski. Boop. It's good to see you. How have you been? Working hard, as always. One of them did have a shotgun on him. We're going in, shotgun.
Live for England, 003. Man, 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 man. He just dies. Stop Diablo before he. He's dead. 100,000 years ago. This time we're not gonna get punched by this dude with superpowers. That's a lot of dudes. Ow, ow, ow. I just punched him in the head. Ugh. Was there another explosive spider moment there? Yeah, I got the shit punched out of me. Damn, hey Yeti, that's a lot of months. Welcome back, man. What you been up to? Chilling? Oh, this, I guess this is where we were supposed to go. It's funny how, like, you still can't really see. Hey, Episaka, what up, man? Chilling out for 12 whole thick ones? Whoa. That's a lot. That's a lot, bro. See what Bond is up to? Trying not to get died. I only have 16 bullets for that gun. You guys remember that really bad Uncharted ripoff? They never finished that game, did they? That makes me sad. <coughs> like, no ammo for, like, no gun. Hey! This is unbelievably hard to navigate. Hey, Ben Riley, I've been doing all right. Unearth, yeah, Unearth. That game sucks, but it was funny. They were supposed to make a part two, and they never did. Now I'm sad about it. Oh shit! Where are all these dudes come from? Oh my god, they're everywhere! Oh shit! God damn! Maya Sanchez, got it. A week long vacation. Oh. You finally got that vacation? Enjoying the vacation? Chilling? Hanging out? Ow! About, it's about damn time, right? Oh my god. I think we found the way out. We did. Now you turn this shit off so I can fucking see. It said open door? You guys saw it said open door, right? What the fuck? What door? Oh. Oh my. I really don't want to die right now. That would suck. That'd be pretty fucking lame. 
This stuff will give you a headache. It's already giving big my eyes. I just see blue everywhere. Double D, double die. I just hate how you kill a goon, he drops a gun, and he drops you like seven bullets. What the fuck are you gonna do with? What are you gonna do with seven bullets? And then now more goons. And I don't want to die. There's so many enemies, there's barely any ammo. Look at all this. I guess we tech. Oh, you know what? I forgot I have this. <laughs> Dude, I was totally expecting to like shoot the thing I'm hiding behind and just dying. I was really honestly expecting that. I missed. One more guy. Oh, we could cheese him. We could cheese him, boys. There we go. Fuck that. I'm trying to live. Collect all this ammo. Anybody a fan of Chris Jericho's dad bod? Hey, DSD. Three rounds for the Desert Eagle. Three whole ass rounds? Really? Oh, we have a shotgun. Fuck yeah. Two shots. Shit. We need more than two shots. This is like a super awesome gun. Oh, these give you a shotgun right there. Jericho and his hot dad bod. That was so funny when that happened. Shotgun, gun, gun, gun. Because in the movie, they're never reloaded. We're supposed to be stealthy, guys. Remember that. Boss fight? Oh no! For you, James. So much ass! No! I think she's dead. Okay. All right. Knock a flower out from under your enemy's feet. Bond moment. Oh, they give you hints. Cool. So much butt in that helicopter. I want to see what happens if you just don't move. I think she's fallen for you, James. Oh! <laughs> she just starts falling the, the helicopter's not even there wow one hit huh one hit How come i hit like four times they're gonna make the helicopter disappear you want to see it it's cool Oh shit. I don't even know where you're supposed to go on that one. Uh, good night, Maya. You, uh. You enjoy your vacation, Ruski. I will chat with you probably later tonight.
This nigga suck. He's just reloading while falling. Yeah, like right here. Where am I? I just guess I just go all the way around. Huh? I'm coming, baby girl. I'm coming. This is fucking ridiculous, man. Oh, shit. Oh. How the fuck are you supposed to catch her? You don't, you don't move fast. Oh, now look, remember before I didn't now. How come all my guns were gone before? Remember bef before when we loaded this, I didn't have any of my guns. Now they were like, yeah, you forgot your guns. Reload. Reload. Oh, fuck. Alexa, turn on the hit scan. Shotgun now. How do I go? Fa oh! How the fuck? How, how do I go so slow? A button makes you die faster. Got it. Got it. I thought holding. Yeah, I was holding forward. It wasn't working. Let's see, let's... Okay, oh. There is no button that makes you go faster. I'm pressing all the... Ooh. Oh, well... Ah! <laughs> A button reloads, B button does nothing. R shoots, L aims. Yeah. I'm holding up. I don't know how the fuck is she going so fast. Yeah, I don't know. You just, yeah, I, I don't know. Sometimes you like catch up. Let's see. If you just don't crash. Getting close, boys. We're kind of close. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Nice to catch up with you again. We've got to get out of here. How? The tank. You'll drive. What? I, I don't. You can learn on the way. Damn. For real? Give me what? Oh, still got a bronze bullshit. Bullshit, dude. He's phoning, phone you, phoning those lines, Pierce. <laughs> You phone in those lines. Oh, look, we're about to get an Asian girl in this mix now. Oh, boy. Which Bond is this? This is Pierce Brosnan. He said that line sounded like Pierce was laying in bed <laughs> on the phone. Take us to Jax. You'll be safe there. All right, hang on. This game is disgusting. Interesting thing. technique, Serena. Careful. Sorry, this is harder than it looks. Oh boy.
got him. Go left. Like I was gonna lower the music. Boy, this, this aim is fucking squirrely as shit, man. This is some squirrely shit. See ya, BT8. Thanks for dropping by, dude. She just all of a sudden gets a burst of speed. Gotta hear her awesome dialogue. We're coming through. Is she talking in tin can? Yeah, pretty much. It's another tank, it's a showdown. Yo, hey. Okay, when you guys check to see if NAC 2 is on sale and how much it is, because I want to play NAC to the future. NAC 2, I played at E3 and it was actually a lot of fun. I think it's 11 bucks right now. Got cock blocked by the fruit van. Knack to knack to the future. Wait here a moment. Bunun. Bunun. Thirteen whole ass ninety nine. Oh, on PSN. Yeah, on the PSN. Hmm. Go left. Going left. It's thirteen bucks, so it's fourteen. And I gotta pay a little bit more if I want a physical. Let's get physical! Go right! Woo! Move, people! We. Damn! Get him! Oh my god, this aiming is so yeah. bad! Got him! Better tanks in Battlefield 5. Speaking of Battlefield 5, somebody mentioned that the Battle Royale came out today. Is it any good? Y'all know what time it is. Those gas pumps, 007. It's your best chance. Blam! Nice. Well, I'm going back in I want time. you to stay here and stay out of sight. Are you coming back? Yeah, she was getting I'll hella close. Touch. You get that little that little butt in that little hut. Put the butt in a little bit of hut. Double O seven, our presence has been detected at the airfield and we must fly out of here immediately. Double O three's Triumph Daytona six hundred should be parked somewhere nearby. Find it and get here as quickly as you can. I'm going, I'm going. Uh Oh my god, this is the... You should be able to use your GPS display by now, 007. Shut up, man. This shit sucks. What the fuck? Why we got a shotgun? You saw 007 just had a shotgun? I 
I'm speeding. I'm speeding. The plane is taxiing to leave. Double seven. You must get on board. I'm trying. Having a little bit of an issue. What the fuck? Why are you slowing down? Nah, we're about to get left. Bye! Mission failed. 007, our presence has been detected at the airfield and we must fly out of here immediately. 003's Triumph Daytona 600 should be part oh, of the I didn't know we had a flamethrower on the car. What? As you can. Oh, shit. My power just flashed, so... If I cut out, I apologize. So our power might be going out soon. Holy shit. Holy smoke. To leave. You must Hold on, shut board. up. Hold on, I'm, only, I'm trying to get this. God damn it. Come on, come on. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. 007, our presence has been detected at the airfield and we must fly. Yeah, my, my power might go out. It, it flickered a little bit. Usually, once it flickers, it'll like go out in a couple minutes. So. I apologize in advance if my shit just cuts out. One-handed shotgun. We're gonna make sure we hit that ramp this time. The plane is taxiing. Put fire up. Oh, I'm going! I'm going! I'm going! Come on, it's cock blocking. Damn. I got cock blocked. Where he keeps the 30 missiles? I think I think in his ass. <laughs> or in the muffler? Yo, I got cock blocked by the, by, the, by the bike. It was slowing me down. Oh, man. Oh. So much shit going on. The plane is taxiing to leave, Double Seven. You must get on board. I mean, if it would slow the fuck down. Ah, oh, god damn it. 007, our presence has been detected at the airfield and we must fly out of here Do wheelies make you go faster? Maybe we have to just, we have to just wheelie that last part. Find it and get here as quickly as you can. Fuck. So many explosions. The plane is taxiing to leave, Double Seven. You must get on board. Damn, you go hella fast with this wheelie. Look at it. Yeehaw! Is that the wheelie through it? Congratulations, you saved the girl and destroyed most of my equipment. I hope you're happy, 007. Better than saving the equipment and losing the girl. Don't you agree? 
Oh, 007, I give up. Nice. Of course, the wheelie makes you go faster, right? They gotta give me something for that. A goal. We've That's added what I thought. Explosive charge to your field reconnaissance device. Yo, Serena got a. Wait, what? Is that a new costume? It's just the same shit, but she got a cowboy hat on and, and jeans. It's a dab mid wheelie to go fast. Okay, what do you guys think of the game so far? Oh, we got an interlude. We can watch that. Let me look at these unlocks. Fuck. What? <laughs> this is a picture. Picture of Willem Dafoe. <laughs> Just look at that. <laughs> Why does he look so like, whoa? Oh, we can activate it with the cowboy hat. Yeah, let's activate it, fuck it. Oh, you can get cheat codes? What, you get the golden gun? It looks like the golden gun. Huh. All right, let's watch this MI6 interlude. Yeah, I, I never finished this game when I was younger, but I really like it. Welcome liked back, it. 007. We have several upgrades for you. Miss Nagai. Your stealth suit will now make you fully invisible. Oh, shit. But be careful. She's a the predator. movements will destroy the effect. I can see where that might be a problem. <clears throat> and the spider cam now carries an explosive. Press the button and boom. I suspect I won't be bringing this one back to Q-Lab. Built to be expendable, 007. I only wish you didn't treat everything I gave you like that. Well, I can be careful when I want to, Q. Isn't there something official you should be doing, 007? Ah, here she is. Yes, we've managed to resurrect your Aston Martin V12 Vanquish. <laughs> Despite your best <laughs> efforts to destroy it on your previous missions, we've equipped it with the usual toys, uh, machine guns, forward-firing rockets, and an acid slick, a rear-deployed deterrent, which will dissolve the vulcanized rubber found in tires. And before you ask 007, yes, it is biodegradable. That's nice. We don't have to drive that dad van anymore. Uh, sure. How many, how many kids we gonna fit in that? So, uh, my beautiful, beautiful chat, I just noticed what time it is, and I am hungry as fuck. Oh! I got a story to tell you guys. It's story time. You guys ready? I made the mistake of going to Subway last night at one in the morning. Boy, Mardi Gras mayhem. That sounds like it's going to be annoying. I got a story. You guys ready for a story? You guys ready? Okay. I'm going to tell you the story and then we're going to we're going to end the stream. So, I don't know why I decided. Oh, now I remember why I decided. My car is fucked up right now, and I can't go above 30 miles per hour without it acting up. So, at 1 in the morning, I was hella hungry, and I couldn't go to... The only places open up at 1 in the morning is either McDonald's or Subway. The Subway was closer, so I'm like, fuck it, I'm just gonna gamble and go to Subway. I go to Subway. First thing that I knew that this was gonna be a crazy night is as I'm walking to Subway, there's a homeless guy sitting in front of Subway that's arguing with himself. He's legitimately, like, calling himself out on his own bullshit. 
He was like, you always, you always sit there and smile in my face like we're friends, but you don't like me. You don't talk to me like I'm a friend. And I thought I loved you, man. How could you? He was like, it was like he was trying to get a BET award, but he's talking to himself. So I walk past that guy and I walk into the subway. There's two women working behind the counter. I go over and I ask about, there's this new sandwich they're promoting called like the green earth tuna or some shit. And they're like, oh, it's got the green earth sauce. I look at her and I go, what's that sauce made out of? Because like, if I, if there's like too much sauce, I get a stomach ache. I'm like, what's in that sauce? She literally just goes, I don't know. I'm like, really? Can I look at it? The sauce looks like baby shit, like green diarrhea, like soft shit. So I'm like, I'm good. I'll, I'll pass on that. Can I get a, can I was like, can I get a foot long honey oat tuna? She grabs the honey oat. By the way, the whole time she's making the food, there is the, the other girl that's there is making like the most fucking extravagant sandwich with just dropping all kinds of shit in it. But she's getting sauce and like shit everywhere. And she's watching like a TV show on her tablet and she's just getting mayonnaise and mustard all over oh, her all over her tablet. Yeah. Yo, Skrillo. Damn, I was just ending, bro. How you been? Can we get a caster command for Skrillo, please? I was just telling a story about my awful uh my awful experience at Subway last night. So the the girl is getting mayonnaise and mustard all over. Her. Yeah, you're playing Catherine too? Everyone's playing Catherine, huh? She's getting mayonnaise and mustard all over her shit. And I you know, we, we're making the sandwich. She she heats up the sandwich, she does whatever she does. Then we get to the sauce part. Here's where the here's where the story starts to get a little juicy. Now, a black man walks in, young man, looks like a maybe 22, 23. He's on the phone, he comes in and he says, Hey, what's the address? What's what's the address here? They just the girls just ignore him. He's like, excuse me, where what's the address here? I'm trying to get a I'm trying to get a ride. I don't have the address. They ignore him. He's like, Hey, excuse me. Hey. One of the girls looks at him. He goes, What's the address here? She looks at the other girl, and the other girl just shrugs her shoulders like, I don't know. And he's just sitting, Y'all don't know the address? No. So I point, there's like a receipt on the table, and I'm like, there's a receipt, just I guess the address will be on the receipt. So he picks up the receipt, he reads the address to whoever he's on the phone with, and he tells me thank you, and he sits down. So then she asks, what kind of stuff do you want on your sandwich? She drops about a pound of fucking spinach on that sandwich. She drops about a fucking pound of onions on there. Just, I have a picture of the sandwich, by the way. I'm going to post it in Discord after I, t after I tell the story. So there's just all this shit in this sandwich. And I go, can I get light mayo and mustard? And can you please not put a lot? She literally like, it's like she's, you know how like, have you ever seen a little kid use a glue, like use a glue stick? You know what I'm talking about? You ever seen like a child use a glue stick? That's how she put mayonnaise on my fucking sandwich. There was so much mayonnaise everywhere. I go, that's a lot of mayonnaise. She's like, it is? That's, can you please take some of it off? So she like scrapes some of the mayonnaise off, but there's so much fucking mayonnaise everywhere that she just gives up. So then I go, can I get mustard? But can you give me one strip of mustard? I don't want as much mustard as you put mayonnaise. She's like, okay. Takes a sandwich, just as slow as possible. That sandwich was probably 90% man, I mean, 90% mustard. She put so much fucking mustard on that sandwich. And she didn't even cut it in half. She couldn't even close the sandwich because there was so much shit in it. She didn't cut it in half. She like cut it in half like halfway and just left it open and wrapped it up. So she wraps it up. She puts it over on the side. I'm like, oh my God, this sandwich is going to be fucking awful. I'm like, I can't believe this. So I'm like, just, and she looked, and I, I was going to ask her to remake it. But when I asked her to like not put the sandwich, like the, the mayonnaise on it, she was already looking disgusted. I was like, I don't want her to fucking put her... Like just spit of some shit in the sandwich, so fucking whatever. So, she's helping me out, and there, there, I don't know if there was any managers, there was only two people there, those are the two people. So, I buy my food, I go over to get a drink, the man that, the guy, the boy that was there, or the man that was there, um, goes over and he asks for a water cup. And he goes, hi, can I, can I, excuse me, can I get a water cup? The two girls are just ignoring him. He goes, can I get a water cup? 
Hello? Hello? He's like snapping his fingers up. Can I get a water cup? One of the girls just looks at him and then continues making her sandwich, getting mayonnaise and mustard all over her tablet. The, she looks at the other girl and she goes, you gotta get him a water cup? And then she just walks away. Like she didn't even hear her. She just wasn't even listening to her. So the girl like sighs really loudly and then goes over and grabs a water cup and hands it to the dude. And the dude is like, what is fucking wrong with these people? So they just don't listen. So like, I just grabbed my food and I just left. And then I got home and I opened up this fucking awful ass sandwich and I'm gonna post it in Discord so y'all can see this nasty ass fucking sandwich. Hold on, I'm about to post it. Y'all ready? I'm gonna post it in Steven Richards. Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready? Where the fuck is the sandwich? Did I delete it? Damn, I think I deleted the picture of the sandwich. Okay, let me go into my deleted pictures. I hope I didn't get rid of it. Oh, no! Never mind. I forgot, I did delete the picture. It should be, uh... Let me find it. Let me get the picture of this sandwich! There we go. Okay, I found it. There you go. Check that sandwich out, boys. Look at that shit. I'll open it up on stream so y'all can enjoy the, the what the sandwich looked like. Hold on. Hey. Look at this fucking sandwich. Look at the sandwich. Look at the sandwich. Look at all this fucking sauce! Look at all the sauce here! Oh, man. Yeah, right? Where's the tuna? There, there's fucking, there's no tuna. It's just, it's just, God damn it. Look at all the sauce, dude. There was mustard everywhere. Oh, man. That lady fucked that sandwich up. I know if I ever go back there again, I'm going to make sure and be like, I do not want you to fuck my sandwich up tonight. So can I have somebody else? Make me a sandwich, because I would like for you to not fuck my sandwich up. Thank you. Look at that. I got mustard everywhere, dude. My fingers were smelling like mustard all night. I even washed my hands and just couldn't get rid of the mustard smell. Because there's so much mustard. I, I opened the sandwich and tried to wipe as much of the sauce out with a paper towel, but I still just couldn't get it all. You swore off Subway almost shit yourself for you after eating it? Yeah, yeah, so... Just, I just can't. This area right here is what just gives me fucking just migraines. Look at this. Look at all this fucking sauce. Do you get more than what you pay for? Yeah. By the way, this sandwich and a drink and chips was $12. $12 for this sandwich, pretty much. Nice. Oh boy, oh boy. Should we gamble and go back tonight, but earlier, before they bring in the people that fuck the sandwiches up? Just no. <laughs> Don't ever go back. <laughs> never, never go back. Stream the subway person. Stream, like, the pull your phone out and be like, I want to record you fucking this sandwich up. Yeah, this is the kind of subway I deal with. I understand that it was one in the morning, and I'm sure they probably stick their employees that can't make sandwiches correctly there at one in the morning, but like, this is really bad. I should have just told her to make it again, but I just don't want to waste food. I should have been like, yeah, you fucking make that shit again. This is bad. Ugh. Just looking at it just pisses me off. <laughs> Fuck the sandwich, man. Make me so mad. Oh, yeah, I barely saw the tuna either. I didn't even think I had a tuna sandwich anymore. I just had a mustard sandwich. Well, that was fun. Thank you for listening to my sandwich rant. But, ladies and gentlemans, um, 
remember I told you guys that I got a bounty for Sekiro, so we're gonna play a little bit of Sekiro because I actually really like the game and I took the bounty so that I could get a PC copy because I'm greedy. Because <laughs> I was gonna probably stream it later anyway, but I mean, you know, was, we can play it for a little bit and then swap back to Bond. We're not gonna do a whole stream of Sekiro unless you guys wanna watch it, but we can do Sekiro for a little bit and then go to Bond if you guys want to play but we'll definitely be streaming either tomorrow or wednesday lucha underground is on so uh thank you guys for hanging out i really appreciate it i'm surprised a lot of you guys uh came out for some bond i gotta find out what games like you know some older i have to go through my backlog i have so many ps2 games and gamecube games that i haven't even played that i'm positive that if I just whipped it out, we'd probably be having some fun, so... Something. So, MXC is on right now, but I don't think you can watch it unless you live in America. So I don't want to do that. Well, let's see who else is streaming. Oh! Speaking of Sekiro, Chrono's playing Sekiro. Let's support him. I love Chrono, he's a good man. And I, it's been a while. It's been a while. Thank you guys for hanging out tonight. I really appreciate it. I need to figure out what I'm gonna eat. Maybe we should. Maybe we should make plans to play that Rugrats Escape from Reptar game again soon, chat. Because a, a lot of people really, I really like that game, and we can beat it in one sitting and just relive the, the battlefields. But thank you all. Yeah, Lucha Underground still a thing, I believe. Thank you all, and I will see you guys next time. Let me turn this off. The Nintendo GameCube. Greatest system of all time. Goodbye, everybody. Oh, I should play some music. We're gonna play this again because I like this song. See you guys.